Do you think his future is still there? Uh, I tend to, although I've got to be honest, since July 4th of 2016, I'm out of the prediction business <laughs> on, you know, on, on where superstars are going to go. So I don't have any idea, but I, you know, I'm reasonably optimistic that he's going to stay. Um, I think he likes the challenge of doing it you know, differently from Durant. Who's going to want to play with him, Barry? Well, now that's a good question. I, you know, I don't even know that playing with him is a problem. I think playing with him would be sort of fun and cool. But working with the guy, going to practice and dinner and airplane flights, that would wear you out, I think. Um, sometimes I wonder if that's why Durant left. Was he just saying, you know what, I've sort of put in my time with this guy. So... Uh, the playing part's fine. I think I think a lot of guys, a lot of really good players, would find it fun playing with Russell Westbrook. But you gotta you gotta sort of accept that intimidating personality the, that he has, and he comes by it honest. I don't know that it's manufactured, so I don't think it's going to change. But what role did all of this play in Durant leaving? Well, I, that I don't know. You know, we all speculate. Um, come up with six, seven, eight different theories. But it's clear that that there was some sort of uh, fractured nature in their relationship that we don't know what the genesis is, but, you know, it's clear from what happened that they uh, weren't as tight as, as uh, they led us to believe. Who would you rather have, Barry? If I said you could have Durant, Harden, or Westbrook? Well, I'd take Kevin Durant mainly because I think he's easier to live with. Uh, no offense to James. Uh, that is offense to Russell, I would say. Yeah, but uh, you keep it, alluding to this. How much of a problem is he? All, is he just a control freak? I think uh, I think he is a control freak. I, control freak might be too heavy, yeah. but it might not be either. I mean, you know, there's a quote from one of the Thunder players, Bleacher Report, or somebody did a story on the music in every locker room. And they asked one of the Thunder players, hey, who, who selects the music for the Thunder locker room? And the player said, everybody knows who runs this locker room. So, you know, it's just, it's really not a question of, of what's going on in, in Oklahoma City. Russell Westbrook is, is running things, uh, and in a lot of ways, throughout the organization. The Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on Audience.